Hello, welcome to English Touring Opera at Home. My name is Philip Turbett. I'm the orchestra manager at English Touring Opera. However, as well as managing the orchestra, I also play the bassoon in the orchestra. I thought I would use this period of lockdown to tell you a little bit about some of the instruments that I've been playing in the orchestra over the past 10 years. The first instrument that I'd like to show you is a very old bassoon from the Renaissance period. In fact, it's not really a bassoon at all. It's actually called the Dulcian. In England, it's also known as the Kirtle. And this is it. It would have been used by composers such as Gabrielli, Schutz, Cavalli, and of course, Monteverdi. I have used the Dulcian in our productions of Monteverdi's Ulysses in autumn 2016, for example. It comes in different sizes, but the most common size is the bass Dulcian. Here's a little sample of what it sounds like. <laughs> This is the instrument that I use when I'm playing the music of Handel and Bach. It looks a little bit more sophisticated than the Dulcian. It has four keys. I'll just turn it round, let you see a little bit. But unlike the Dulcian, which is made out of one solid piece of wood, the Baroque bassoon here is made out of four pieces of wood. There's one, two, three, four. Here's a little sample of what the Baroque bassoon sounds like. The next instrument that I'd like to show you is my classical bassoon. This is the instrument I use for Mozart, Beethoven and Haydn. In fact, this is the instrument that I've been using in our current production of Mozart's Cosi van Tutti. It is slightly different to the Baroque bassoon in that it has a few more keys added. This instrument has nine keys. If I just turn it around, I'll show you. So it has nine keys and this is actually a copy of an instrument that was made by the famous German maker Heinrich Grenzer. Here's a little sample of what it sounds like. And finally, I come up to date with my modern bassoon here. As you will notice, if I put it alongside my Baroque bassoon, there's a vast amount of key work on it. This instrument has 28 keys and is made out of maple wood. Here's a little excerpt from Kurt Weill's wonderful Silver Lake that we performed last autumn. My last musical example is a little bit more light-hearted. It was composed by my bassoon teacher, a wonderful musician and dear friend called Vernon Elliott. So, there you have it, a little insight into the various bassoons that I use with English Touring Opera. Many thanks for supporting and following English Touring Opera. We all look forward to playing for you again in the not too distant future. Stay safe and healthy.